Welcome to my channel once again. In the next few minutes, I'm going to be taking you guys through a step-by-step -step process on how you can turn your Facebook profile into a Facebook page and then start making money from your Facebook. If you are a very good observer, you notice that guys like you are moving over to Facebook and then creating more and more content on Facebook. I might be curious to know what is it I don't know about or where are these guys moving over to Facebook and then creating more and more content on the Facebook page. So if you are yet to turn your Facebook profile into a Facebook page, then you are already missing out. But you don't need to panic because in this very tutorial video, I'm going to be taking you guys to a step-by-step -step guide on how to get started with that. So Facebook actually considers the fact that people who have been on Facebook over the years building their profile, it will actually be so unfair that for you to monetize your Facebook and turn it into a page, you need to start over building a page. That will be so much pain and a whole lot of hard work. So now there's a new feature on Facebook which is known as the Facebook professional mode. So that's the feature we are actually going to be looking at in order to turn our Facebook profile into a Facebook page and then get our Facebook monetized. So the question right now is what is Facebook professional mode? Facebook professional mode is that particular feature that will enable us to assess all the possibilities that a page will have when it has to do with and monetization. So from Google point of view here, it says Facebook professional mode gives you access to a bundle of professional tools and insight that can help you build your professional present from your Facebook profile. So a profile is a place on Facebook where you can share information about yourself such as interest, photos, videos, current city and hometown. So Facebook page are places on Facebook where artists public figures, businesses, brands, organizations, and non-profits can connect with their fans or customers. So right now, we are going to dive into screen and then look into the criteria which it takes to monetize your Facebook profile or Facebook page and then get on process properly. So guys, right here is on my Facebook professional mood profile. But I, right now, as you can see, I'm already on a Facebook professional mode which you can see that's why it's displaying this way so right now i'm gonna um let's look out to see what my dashboard looks like guys okay, so this is one of the unique feature of uh, being on uh, facebook professional mode because you can actually see your performance what your facebook have actually done in the past few days your growth level and and all of that as you can see uh, from my performance here i have been able to reach out to like 33.7k people in the previous in the previous days and you can see my engagement and the net followers which i've gotten in the previous um, 28 days as you can see and right now as you can see i i have 4462 followers still left with them some numbers before i can reach to the reach them 5000 followers which is one of the criteria so um in the course of this video um, i'm i'm gonna be um showing you guys because currently now there's a challenge with some persons who have actually reached a um, facebook criteria for um, monetization but um, are unable to to get on it due to the fact that um, they are their country of residence is not a um, shortlisted it's not shortlisted on the facebook eligibility list so towards the end of this video i'm gonna show you guys how to how to actually bypass that very that very challenge the strategy or the technique which we people use in order to um, get over that very well so you just have to um stick to this video and stay with it till the very end so you can see here uh, my performance here so let me just look out to see my insight you can see my post reach and all of that so you can actually get all of these statistics right here so right now um for in case you are not on facebook professional yet and you want to um, switch to a professional mode what you need to do is just to click on this um, three 
dot here at um, the right side of your screen right here so i'm going to click on it right now so clicking on it clicking on it right now you can see um, the options which are provided right here you can see a turn off professional mode that if if at all i was on a um, facebook normal profile here will be written a um, turn on professional mode but for the fact that i'm already on a um, facebook professional mode i wouldn't want to um, turn it off because i'm um, turning it off and um, involve um, some side effect of that but um, uh, let me just um, click on it and show you what it entails right here so you can see i'm in prompt right here so i'm just gonna continue okay you can see here when you turn off professional mode there are some things that actually change this so let's see what changes any of your existing inside you no longer be available that's one of the effects of um, turning off your professional mood and what stays is your current friends followers and profile content those ones will still remain so if you should turn off your professional mood and then later turn it turn it on again your existing inside that is your performance which you've done in the previous days will no longer be available again so i wouldn't turn it off i, I just need to get this out I'll show you guys um, the effect of i am um, turning off your professional mode so i'll just go back okay so if you are yet to um, turn your profile to a professional mode all you need to do is just to um, click on this three dots right here and then it's it's simple and straight to the point to do that so and at the top here you can see where to um, switch profiles where to switch profile but before then let me just take take you guys um to a process on how to um, create a facebook page which is very very important so in order to create a facebook page you click on um, these three these three lines here at the top right of your screen and then you come down here to pages you can see where we have um, pages right here so you just click on pages so once you click on pages the next thing you do is to um, click on create create you can see create here so you just click on create so so to create page you just get started with the process it's just very simple with you use get started using your preferred um, page name and then you are good to go but since i have a facebook page already uh, so i wouldn't need to um, create another facebook page you can see here you click in final that's it you know, my facebook page so i'm just gonna open it so to see how it looks like so this is my facebook um, page this is from um, a viewer perspective that is if you are the one i'm um, coming to my facebook page this is how it will appear but um, let me log in and let me switch from my professional mode to facebook page so in order to switch from my facebook professional mode to um, a facebook page i'll just click on this um we i have bill clinton as a here so i'll just click on this arrow pointing to the down here so this is how to easily switch to your facebook page from your facebook profile so i'll just click on the bill clinton finance So right now i'm on my facebook page properly i'm on my facebook page properly you can see you can see uh, a new page actually just a few weeks i created this page you can see just i have 28 followers so the next thing i'm going to be showing uh, showing us in this video is how to uh, look into the uh, facebook page eligibility criteria very very important as you can see um, the name of this my facebook page is um, Bill Clinton finance so everything i'm talking about on this page is all about finance so like one one thing you need to know about um, um being a content creator is that uh, you must have a particular niche you must have a particular niche which you just want to um, focus focus on instead of um, posting random random things 
on your uh, Facebook page most have a particular area of concentration you understand maybe it depending on you you might choose to uh, maybe i uh, be posting memes or you might choose to maybe uh, be posting um, current happening maybe news what's trending and and all of that you understand so depending on you but uh, you must ensure that um, all of your content which you are actually dishing out on your facebook professional timeline or your facebook page must be valuable must be valuable content it must be valuable content which you are actually teaching out so in order to look eligibility criteria i'll just click on these three dots here so you can see the options popping up so i'll click on this admin tools i'll click on admin tools so admin tools here you can see uh, my performance in the last 28 days you can see my performance right here net followers interaction and reach so and if you still want to see the all the insights for the post you can see them here okay so right here right the i'll come down to um creators support i'll come down here to creators support because i want to see how to the um, eligibility criteria and all of that so the next thing i'll do is to click on um, monetization so under monetization here you can see um, program eligibility see if you are eligibility to earn money on facebook so i'll click on this um, program eligibility so right here we have um, other options here check your page eligibility so i'll click on this first one okay how to check your monetization eligibility on a facebook page or profile okay you can just um, come down to read all of this but um, right here i'll click on this and um, check your page in stream ads eligibility so i'll click I'll click on this very option. So I'll scroll down to where I have the eligibility requirement. So you can see right here eligibility requirements for video on demand. So you can see here, one of the eligibility criteria here is 5,000 followers. Yeah, it's, it's actually very easy to get 5,000 followers like it's it's not a very big or difficult task to to do that and the second eligibility requirement right here is 60,000 total minute viewed in the last 60 days before now before now the eligibility criteria for um, Facebook monetization is to be 10,000 um, followers and then um, I think I'm um, 600,000 total minutes minutes viewed so um, Facebook have actually um, slashed down that criteria making it uh, more easier for content creators to actually start um, earning money on Facebook. So the third one we have here says um, page has at least five active videos. Videos can be on demand or previously live, but this doesn't include active cross-posted videos. So these are some of the um, criteria which you need to take into consideration which you need to take into consideration so we are going to um, look out to the next one so i'll just go back okay let's look at this um, add-on reels so what are the eligibility requirements for add-ons Facebook reels. It says you must be invited to the program. You must be on a page, new page or professional mode for profiles. So before you can be eligible, eligible to start earning on a um, Facebook ad on reels, you must either be on a um, Facebook professional mode or Facebook page. So either of those two, you can be eligible to start earning and you must be at least 18 years old and you can see right here it says you also must reside in one of the following 
countries like i like i told you before the starting of this video that there are some countries which are not shortlisted on this list so towards the end of this video i'll be telling you how you can actually bypass that if you are residing in a country which is not on this list so you can see here we have argentina australia denmark egypt el Salvador, france germany and all of that and all of those countries you can see turkey saudi arabia ukraine united arab Emirates, and united kingdom so if you look closely you realize that um, some countries like um, nigeria is not on this list and also which other country you don't have okay nigeria is not on this list and some other country but hopefully hopefully um in due time uh, facebook might actually um bringing some advancement short listing um, other countries which are actually not on this list but before then there is also a technique which guys are using to um, start earning or start getting paid or monetizing their facebook irrespective of the fact that um, their country which they reside is not on this list so um just stick to this video i'll show you guys tell you guys how to bypass that so that's some of the criteria or eligibility requirement for add on facebook views so let's um, look out to in-stream ads so you need to know that i'm um, one of the easiest way to um, get your facebook monetized or one of the most common most common feature which guys out there are using to get their facebook monetized is um, through this in-stream ad in-stream ad is very easy to get your facebook monetized so how to check your in-stream ads eligibility on facebook so let's look out to that so eligibility requirement for video on the okay i think it's almost the same thing we we read in the previous in the previous feature we actually opened it says 5000 followers 60000 total million so it's actually the same thing and eligibility requirement for live video csa is that you must have minimum of 10,000 followers and then 600,000 total minutes viewed. So before you even get to 10,000 followers, you must um, have 5,000 followers first. So before you get here, probably you, you definitely start um, earning from your Facebook from the first eligibility requirement. So that's that for um, Facebook in stream ads. So another Another uh, unique one we need to look out to is um, branded content on Facebook Reels. Let's see what this very one entails. So it says um, branded content on Facebook Reels, a new way to partner with brands. Wow. So what is um, branded content on Facebook Reels? It says, as part of our ongoing commitment to help creators turn their passion into a living, we are launching branded content on Facebook Reels globally. Reels is the fastest growing new format on Facebook, making Reels an excellent format for creators to utilize branded content campaigns on. Creators can now use the branded, branded content Tag to paid partnership with label on Facebook Reels in their organic post. It means that um, with with branded content, you can actually partner with um, with companies or um, organization and then tag them. It will be more of like sponsored sponsored post. You understand? Sponsored post on your reels whereby you can tag them using them. Um, the branded content tools you can tag them on your reels and then while promoting your video you are also promoting that very brand and then you get paid for it so that's just um, the idea behind um, facebook and um, branded content so th this is a very unique it's a very unique one it's a very unique one so so these are some of the some of the um, features we we are gonna be looking 
at in this video you yourself you can actually uh, give more attention to the rest of it and then see what they are all about you understand so like i said that i'm towards the end of this video i'm gonna be telling you guys how to how to um bypass that very challenge in a situation whereby your country is not um shortlisted on the eligibility list so countries what um guys do is that um countries whereby they are not um, shortlisted on that very eligibility list what they do is that what you need to do is that um, you need to reach out to people or someone who is a um, resident in any of the eligible countries maybe for instance now so um south africa is on the list of um, eligible countries so probably if you are a nigerian or someone in another country which is not eligible what you need is that you will as for your facebook page then you need to make that person an admin in fact as a nigerian knowing that um, you are not eligible you are not eligible to um, monetize your facebook you must not in fact you must not even try the mistake of starting the process you must not even start the process to even try if not you end up spoiling the whole thing for yourself so what you need to do is that you will need make someone an admin an admin on your facebook page someone residing in an eligible country so once you make the person an admin on your facebook page the person will now be the one to um, begin the process of applying for monetization he or she will be the one to begin the process of applying for monetization because there are some there are some um, details there are some details and um, credentials that will be required from the person like um, bank bank details and all of that so the person will now use his own personal details from that very country to apply for this um, monetization on your behalf and believe me it's not actually free you guys who are doing this are not will not actually do it for you for free and it must not be any must not reach out to any other kind of person because i'm there are a whole lot of scammers out there you can just um, hack your um, facebook page and that and that's all you understand so uh, where the, the question right now is uh, where can i get these people can i get these people or can i get someone to actually do this for me so one of the platforms which popular platform where you can get guys like this to actually help you on doing this is on uh, fiverr there are guys out there on fiverr which their work is just to uh, help you get your facebook monetized and then you pay them you understand and then you pay them so you can get someone on fiverr to actually do this for you or if you have someone outside the country maybe in south africa or anywhere saudi arabia so you can actually reach out to someone like that to help you apply for facebook and monetization so as you can see that um facebook is just one of the um other social media which guys are going into massively to see how to how they can monetize it and then start making money so thank you for watching this very video don't hesitate to leave a comment in the comment section wherever you are challenged and then like this video to stimulate the youtube algorithm then lastly don't forget to subscribe to this channel so and turn on the notification bell so that whenever i drop a vital video like this you'll be notified thank you